In this video, we're diving deep into what most writers get wrong about ChatGPT. If you're ready to uncover the two biggest mistakes that writers make, stick around. Once you fix these, it'll drastically improve the quality of your AI assisted writing. How often has your roommate or partner said something like, hey, can you grab that for me without providing you with any context? How annoying is that? Uh, how are you like supposed to figure out what they want? That's exactly the kind of mistake that people tend to make when they're interacting with ChatGPT. So the first common blunder that writers make with prompts is that they're way too vague. If you ask ChatGPT to tell you about space, you gotta think about like, where do you want it to start? Space is so vast and mysterious. You're gonna get a response that's way too broad or generic if you ask it like that. So instead, try something like, describe what a journey to Mars would be like, highlighting the challenges faced by the astronauts. See how different that is. Clarity is the key. The second problem the writers make with ChatGPT, let me tell you a quick story that you can probably relate to. So as a kid, I was helping my dad with a DIY project around the house, and he asked me to pass him a Phillips screwdriver, and I didn't know what that was, so I went and looked at the toolbox. I had no idea what I was looking for, so then I had to go ask him for clarification. He told me, oh, it's the red one. So I went back and looked again. Every screwdriver in the toolbox had a red handle. How does this relate to ChatGPT? Well, the second mistake that writers make is that their prompts are way too short. They don't provide all of the necessary information that you need to do what it wants you to do. So picture this, use ch you tell ChatGPT, tell me a compelling story about a detective. It seems pretty straightforward, right? But here's the catch, ChatGPT doesn't have access to your imagination and what you're thinking. How does it know if you want the story to be a detective story set in like a cyberpunk world or be like a medieval, <laughs> like an ancient Sherlock Holmes detective story? Uh, so to get the best results, you need to provide context, character details, and plot points in your prompts. Get specific. The more information you can give it, the closer the prompt will be to your original vision. Before I share the last point, can I prompt you to hit the like button? Uh, see what I did there? Anyways, the third mistake the writers make. This one is extra tricky because it doesn't matter how great your prompt is, you can still fall into this problem and that is an over-reliance on AI. Look, AI-generated content is fantastic, but it's not a one-stop shop. It should complement your creativity and your expertise, but it shouldn't replace it entirely. So don't get too lazy with it. Remember, AI is still getting better, but it's not infallible, so you gotta check for errors and inconsistencies that can sneak into your writing. So you still need to be the editor-in-chief of your work. Don't let AI go unchecked.